Amelanchier, Wikipedia article audio. About 20, see text. Amelanchier, also known as Shadbush, Shadwood, or Shadblow, Serviceberry or Sarvisberry, or just Sarvis, Juneberry, Saskatoon, Sugarplum, or Wild Plum, and Chuckley Pear is a genus of about 20 species of deciduous leaved shrubs and small trees in the rose family. Selected Species Garden Hybrids Amelanchia is native to temperate regions of the Northern Hemisphere, growing primarily in early successional habitats. It is most diverse taxonomically in North America, especially in the northeastern United States and adjacent southeastern Canada, and at least one species is native to every U.S. state except Hawaii and to every Canadian province and territory. Two species also occur in Asia, and one in Europe. The taxonomic classification of shad bushes has long perplexed botanists, horticulturalists, and others, as suggested by the range in number of species recognized in the genus, from 6 to 33, in two recent publications. A major source of complexity comes from the occurrence of hybridization, polyploidy, and apomixis making species difficult to characterize and identify. The various species of Amelanchier grow to 0.2 a euro 20 m tall, some are small trees, some are multi-stemmed, clump-forming shrubs, and yet others form extensive low shrubby patches. The bark is grey or less often brown, and in tree species smooth or fissuring when older. The leaves are deciduous, colon, alternate, simple, lanceolate to elliptic to orbiculate, 0.5 a euro 10 x 0.5 a euro 5.5 cm, thin to coriaceous, with surfaces above glabrous or densely tome in toes at flowering, and glabrous or more or less hairy beneath at maturity. The inflorescences are terminal with 1 a euro 20 flowers, erect or drooping, either in clusters of 1 to 4 flowers, or in racemes with 4 a euro 20 flowers. The flowers have 5 white, linear to orbiculate petals, 2.6 a euro 25 mm long, with the petals in one species often andropetalous. The flowers appear in early spring when the shad run according to North American tradition. The fruit is a berry-like poem, red to purple to nearly black at maturity, 5 a euro 15 mm diameter, insipid to delectably sweet, maturing in summer. Amelanchier plants are valued horticulturally, and their fruits are important to wildlife. For North American species, the taxonomy follows the flora of North America, for Asian species the flora of China, and for the one European species the flora Europea. Since classifications have varied greatly over the past century, species names are often used interchangeably in the nursery trade. Several natural or horticultural hybrids also exist and many A. arborea and A. canadensis plants that are offered for sale are actually hybrids, or entirely different species. A. A. grandiflora is another hybrid of garden origin, between A. arborea and A. laevis. The cultivar A. urola palama euro trademark has gained the Royal Horticultural Society A. euro trademark S. award of garden merit. Etymology a taxon called Amelanchier lamarckii is very widely cultivated and naturalized in Europe, where it was introduced in the 17th century. It is apomictic, breeding true from seed, and probably of hybrid origin, perhaps descending from a cross between A. laevis and either A. arborea or A. canadensis. While A. lamarckii is known to be of North American origin, probably from eastern Canada, 
it is not known to occur naturally in the wild in North America. The origin of the generic name Amelanchia is probably derived from Amelanchia R, Amelanchia R, the Provena Al names of the European Amelanchia ovalis. Ecology the name serviceberry comes from the similarity of the fruit to the related European sorbus. A fanciful etymology explains the name serviceberry by noting that the flowers bloom about the time roads in the Appalachian Mountains became passable, allowing circuit-riding preachers to resume church services. A similar etymology says that blooming serviceberry indicated the ground had thought enough to dig graves so burial services could be held for those who died in the winter when the only way to deal with the bodies was to allow them to freeze and wait for spring. Both of these fanciful etymologies are unlikely to be correct since the term is attested for both English and New World species as early as the 16th century, well before settlement of English North America, and serviceberry is far from unique in blossoming early in the year. Juneberry refers to the fruits of certain species becoming ripe in June. The name Saskatoon originated from a Cree noun Mesa sent squata mina for Amelanchia alnifolia. The city of Saskatoon, Saskatchewan is named after this plant. Uses and Cultivation Shadberry refers to the shad runs in certain New England streams which generally took place about when the trees bloomed. Garden History Amelanchia plants are preferred browse for deer and rabbits, and heavy browsing pressure can suppress natural regeneration. Caterpillars of such Lepidoptera as brimstone moth, brown tail, grey dagger, mottled umber, rough prominent, the satellite, winter moth, and the red-spotted purple and the white admiral, as well as various other herbivorous insects feed on Amelanchia. Many insects and diseases that attack orchard trees also affect this genus, in particular trunk borers and gymnosporangium rust. In years when late flowers of Amelanchia overlap those of wild roses and brambles, bees may spread bacterial fire blight. The fruit of several species are excellent to eat raw, tasting somewhat like a blueberry, strongly accented by the almond-like flavor of the seeds. Selections from Amelanchia alnifolia have been chosen for fruit production, with several named cultivars. Other cultivars appear to be derived from hybridization between A. alnifolia and A. stolonifer. Propagation is by seed, divisions, and grafting. Service berries graft so readily that grafts onto other genera, such as Crataegus and Sorbus, are often successful. Fruit is harvested locally for pies and jams. The Saskatoon berry is harvested commercially. One version of the Native American food pemmican was flavored by service berry fruits in combination with minced dried meat and fat. The wood is brown, hard, close-grained, and heavy. The heartwood is reddish-brown, and the sapwood is lighter in color. It can be used for tool handles and fishing rods. Native Americans used it for arrow shafts. Members of the Pitt River tribe would use the wood to create a sort of body armor, crafting it into a heavy robe or overcoat and corset armor worn during fighting. Several species are very popular ornamental shrubs, grown for their flowers, bark, and fall color. All need similar conditions to grow well, requiring good drainage, air circulation, watering during drought and soil appropriate for the species. George Washington planted specimens of Amelanchier on the grounds of his estate, Mount Vernon, in Virginia. Amelanchier alnifolia a Euro Saskatoon serviceberry, alder-leaved shadbush, Saskatoon, Saskatoon berry, 
AMA copyright Lanchier a fuelis d'on, Amalanchier amabilis a euro lovely shad bush, AMA copyright Lanchier grisier, Amalanchier arborea a euro downy shad bush, Amalanchier australis, Amalanchier bartramiana a euro mountain shad bush, AMA copyright Lanchier de Bartram, Amalanchier canadensis a euro eastern shad bush, Indian pear, AMA copyright Lanchier du Canada, Amalanchier humilis a euro low shad bush, AMA copyright Lanchier bass, Amalanchier interior a euro wigans, shad bush, AMA copyright Lanchier de Elinta copyright rur, Amalanchier laevis a euro smooth shad bush, Allegheny serviceberry, AMA copyright Lanchier glabra, Amalanchier Nantucket ensis a euro Nantucket serviceberry, Amalanchier ovalis a euro snowy mespalus, Amalanchier sanguini a euro red twigged shad bush, AMA copyright Lanchier sanguin, Amalanchier sinica a euro Chinese serviceberry, Amalanchier spicata a euro thicket shad bush, AMA copyright Lanchier and a copyright pies, Amalanchier utahensis a euro utah service berry.